design and to build prototype weapons. So the Army Air Force chose Wendover and then, and then they notified Tibbetts. Tibbetts in his later years typically said he chose the base, but he didn't. It's the Army Air Force that chose it. So he came here in September and, uh, and looked at the base, but there wasn't a hangar big enough for a B-29. So you know my paintings hung in here. The only paintings ever hung in here. A, uh, a B-29 sitting in here is 141 foot wingspan. From girder to girder is 180 feet. So when a B-29 is in here, there's 20 feet between the wingtip and the girder. You, you could get two in here if you brought one in that way and one in that way and then kind of angled their noses, but it would have been would have been super crowded. And the tail is set, is 31 feet tall, so the little the little door there with the X on it, <laughs> there's one up here, and there's a crank on the side that's counterweighted, and you crank that door up so the tail will come in the, in the building. So was the Enola Gay itself in here? <clears throat> Enola Gay boxcar, there were 15 atomic mission planes. They were all they were all here. At and Tippett's office was in here too, correct? So they were they were in here. I was always told Tippett's office was up there in the corner. Is that right? Yeah, Tipp Tippett's office. The, the bottom floor here on the south side, there was a engine shop, a supercharger shop, and a and a kind of a maintenance shop. The upstairs were offices, and Tippett's office was up in the corner on the on the right up there. Wasn't that long ago? It looked like it was ready to fall down, right? I says, uh, it, it was just a few years ago, this thing was all but falling down. It was. I used to come in here and hang my paintings, me and Annika in here. Yeah, and it was, it was in, in bad shape. Boy. So anyway, and then on this other, on this other side, the what? Yeah, well. They were huge. They, were, they filled up the whole place. One plane took up the whole building. Yeah, almost from one side to the other. There's a propeller shop in the back. A B-29 propeller assembly is 16 and a half feet in diameter. And so that propeller shop, there was a trolley and they could keep complete propeller assemblies back. Come here, Atlee. I want you to hold this. Hold the camera for me. So that's a crane from Japan. Here, give me the yeah, whip the piece. Oh, good job, I like it like that. It's already running. So, so it's the 6th of August, 75th anniversary, so right here, I was standing right here two years ago, hold on, stop, two years ago when Sudoku's niece handed me this, standing right there, got to hold the paper, oh, don't drop the paper crane. So the real one is in there. I got to hold it in my hand right here. So sad day in Japan. My heart goes out for everybody. God forbid this ever happens to me. Yeah. We'll quote Hoover after the bomb. Dorothy Day, true man, true man, true man, but Hoover. No, in the history of mankind, in warfare, never have indiscretionally been women and women killed. It revolts my soul. There's Slim Jim guy. Alright, turn it off.